We're just at the beginning of November, but this month is going to go fast. And then we'll burn through December like nothing because of the holidays and everything. And then all of a sudden we'll be on a plane headed to Costa Rica. She's been to Costa Rica twice now. Yeah. And she's been saying for years that I needed to go to Costa Rica with her. The prior times I've gone to Costa Rica has been with my cousin's um, wellness retreat. And um, again, not sponsored, but absolutely amazing. Um, it's for the ladies. And um, only the ladies. Yeah. So I've always come back and told Dan, you know, I want him to go with us. And he's like, well, can there be a men's retreat? <laughs> I was like, I was like, no, because then I can't go. But um, yeah, it's not fair. They do like zip lining and kayaking and surfing and we do stuff to feed our soul, and that's what it's all about: is unwinding, getting off the grid. So no, there's no Facebooking, no Twittering, no social stuff that week. Um, if you choose not to do that, and I choose not to do that, when I go to Costa Rica, it's me and nature, and I don't, I don't care about texting, watching videos, doing anything. I, my phone stays in the room the whole time. She will text me good night though. I will, it's I really will. Sweet. And, you know, we, we use WhatsApp um, to do that. And um, it's a free app. Again, not sponsored, but that's what I use while I'm in Costa Rica to communicate with him. And um, and yeah, I'll tell him, but he knows that if he doesn't hear from me one day, it's okay. I'm, I'm not dead. Yeah, okay. she, didn't, she didn't fall out of the tree and break something. <laughs> yes, and does have an emergency list. So if something did happen, he'd be getting a phone call, not a, not a WhatsApp message. So. But it is an absolutely amazing uh, event. It's um, Wellness Adventures uh, from my cousin. We'll put and a link below. We'll, we'll put the link below later, but it is absolutely amazing. And if you ever get the opportunity, ladies, to go, um, take advantage of it. And I'll probably be there with you. I'm pretty excited about Costa Rica from both the opportunity to take some videos and also the opportunity to take some pretty cool pictures. Great. Now my left arm's getting all wore out. And let me just clarify, we're, we're not going to touristy Costa Rica. Oh, yeah, no. We go to the Osa Peninsula, which is um, off the grid pretty much. And um, lots of people go to Costa Rica and see all the, you know, the touristy sites and this and that. and Volcano um, and whatnot. You, yeah, you get a chance to go to the Osa. Um, you're, you're away from everything. And it's... Um, just an amazing adventure. You're off the grid. You have to rent a four-wheel drive vehicle to get there because um, there are no like paved roads, <laughs> um, and you're going to be driving through rivers and stuff to get to where we're staying. So, or you can um, fly. You can't fly to where we're staying. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, Things I didn't know. Yeah, you, yeah, we fly into Puerto Jimenez, and then we have to rent a car to go like 45 minutes or a SUV, four wheel drive SUV, to go about 45 minutes to get to where we're staying, uh, which is just very remote. So um, so yeah, just had to throw that in there. Yeah, basically it sounds like when the lights are out, it's dark. Yeah. Yeah, the whole um, Costa Rica is, is um, well, the OSA is on solar power. So they don't, they don't have electricity grids and stuff like that. It's all based on solar power. So if everybody there uses up the solar power during the day, it gets dark fast. So, um, so everybody there is very respectful of not taking equipment or, you know, blow dryers, curling irons, things like that, that are going to use the energy, unnecessary energy. So, um, you know, of course you can charge your phone, but unplug your charger when you're not using it you know just everything that you do they just ask you to unplug it when you're not using it turn it off turn the lights off if you're not using them um just basic common knowledge um respect common respect yeah yeah just common sense basically but um but of course you'll probably always have people that abuse that but for the majority of people that don't then it makes it worth it you know to to be able to do um just sustain their environment and their beautiful forest. And it's just, it's worth it to go off the grid. And they have lots of, well, they have some surfing around there. 
There's apparently some places a little bit further north of where we're staying that are like Costa Rica's surfing mecca. So if you're into surfing, it's still relatively off the grid, but it's uh, supposed to be really good place to go surfing. So one of the things that we're hoping to do while we're in Costa Rica is maybe go see the turtles. They have uh, baby turtles they release out to the wild and you get to stand around and watch them make their journey. I think I have a clip. I may include that in this video. Marie took clips to when she was it. there. I got to see it last time I was there. It was just amazing. So. So yeah, all sorts of wildlife. We're we're on the objective of seeing all the monkeys in both sloths. Because <laughs> we want to be special like that. I don't think they give you a badge or anything or a certificate, but you know. The, mon the monkeys won't be a problem, but where we stay in Costa Rica, the sloths are, you got to find them because Again, if you go to the touristy part of Costa Rica, they have they have um, different environments you can go into where they know they keep them there, and so you know you're going to see a sloth. But in the Osa, there it's all natural, so you just have to hope that you'll see one. <laughs> yeah, uh, my arm's tired. The battery's almost dead, so I think we're going to end here, and uh, we'll catch you in the next episode. Thank you. Oh, also, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the like, the thumbs up, and subscribe. We're, and if you liked it a lot, share it. Yeah, oh yeah, definitely <laughs> share it. That'd be totally awesome. Anyways, thank you. Bye. Bye. We'll see you next time. <laughs>